Yo, it's the Bong again at YouTube channel. So in today's video, guys, we're going to change our old QB Core default phone into the latest version of iPhone inspired QB phone. So actually, I added a link in the description for these resources so you can download it. Simply. And because we have the latest QB Core framework, we're going to download the latest version by just following what I did in this video. Once you download the files, you have to go to your download folder location and then you have to extract the files from RAR into normal folder. And if you don't have a WinRAR, then you can use 7 save because you need to extract everything that is compressed. And finally, this is the files that we need. And uh, let's go back to our file location of our QB core and then we have to uh, back up our QB phone by just uh, simply adding it as a compressed file and then we have to delete uh, the late I mean we have to delete the main file. So the reason that we need to uh, back up the latest the old version of QB phone it's because we need it if this thing won't work. Now next up is we have to copy the files from the download folder into our resources. Now open the folder that you added earlier which is QB phone and then you will see there is an SQL here. So what are we going to do is we are going to open the Heidi SQL and of course we have to delete the the default QB phone data from this database. So the reason that we need to delete the old uh, SQL of QB phone it's because if we did not do this thing then we will have problems uploading this new sql now we need to copy the latest sql then we have to paste it here then we run this one and then we're good to go now let's start our server and see if we have errors making this thing happen on our server of course Oh, there's no problem in it, as you can see. Now, open, let's open our pipem and let's test this out. So if you want to use the camera, then you have to add a webhook on the config files of this script. I think everything works except for this garage so I hope that you like this video and I hope that this video will help you on your server development and please don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more videos like this thank you bye